I'm Lisa Cohen and you're watching Into the Abyss, your number one source for conspiracy theories, controversial topics, and casual conversations. Here with me today is Aria, a movie theorist. Hi, thanks for being here. Hi Lisa, thank you for having me today. Um, she believes that um, movies are actually all real. We have been tricked by the government into believing that these are fake, but they're actually all real and have all happened before. Mm -hmm. Very true. You're, you're absolutely right. That's exactly what I think. Care to elaborate? Yeah, sure. Um, um, when, did, when did you realize this was occurring? Okay, so when I was a kid, I had a class, and my teacher's name was Miss Nordberry. And if you know anything about movies, you know that that is the math teacher in Mean Girls. Oh. So I was like, hmm. That sounds very familiar. I wonder if this movie was real. So I started doing my research and I found out that these are all real people and that this really happened. And then so I started researching all movies and they're all real. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Um, so you had Mrs. Nordberry as a teacher? Yes. Oh my gosh. And, and, and what other movies have you realized that are actually real? I mean, all of them. But like specifically, I did a lot of research on Jurassic Park which everybody knows, by directed by Steven Spielberg. Um, so, that, I mean, alligators came from dinosaurs. Um, so, theirs was, like, tipped me off a little bit, and I was like, okay, let me look into this. And then, like, all the scientific research in that movie is real. Like, you could really recreate dinosaurs. So I was like, if this could be done, obviously it was done. Like, who would make this up? Like, no one's smart enough to make up creating dinosaurs like they obviously did it like i can't wait to like go visit that island and see the dinosaurs for myself i mean technically it was all destroyed in the last movie but like i mean i i'm, I'm assuming in the one that's coming out that they have fixed it in the meantime so oh. it's it'll be it'll be fun to like visit the dinosaurs for real what where where are they supposed to be in the pacific ocean oh and and do you so, I'm do you sorry. want another example? Do you do you like another example? I, I would, thank you. Okay, uh, so Star Wars. So you know how they build spaceships and stuff. I mean, like that's completely real. Haven't you seen the kids walking around with lightsabers in the streets? Like, that's real. Like, how did nobody see that this is real? Everyone's like, oh, it's so fake. And I'm like, well, there's so much evidence around you. Just like open your eyes and just look. Like lightsabers, spaceships. Like time travel is almost possible. We have mathematicians. Like clearly, they could come up with this on their own. So like. It's, it's definitely all real. I just never have met these people. It's just in a different like galaxy. So obviously it's not in our galaxy, but it's, a, it's in a different one. So they must have sent people there through like a wormhole, which is possible according to science. So they went through the wormhole, filmed all of it, and then came back, brought it back for us so we could see what else is going on out in the universe. Oh. So it's like, it's like really cool to like read about all the theories online, but <laughs> and know that people like don't believe this. And I know that it's all real. Like, there's no way any of the, Who would come up with this stuff? Like, it's, it's clearly all real. I want to backtrack a little bit. Um, are sure. You, are you saying that the, the toy lightsabers are real, that they're not just toys? Yes. Obviously. But you can buy them in a Halloween shop. I mean, yeah. But, like, they're real. Like, they brought them down and then remade them. Oh. It's true. It's, it's very wow. true. Wow, I, I didn't know that. I might just go buy one when I leave. <laughs> there you go. See, science. <laughs> um, and, and so um, why do you think the government wants to hide this from everyone? Because they don't want everybody to know that these things really exist. To get kids' hopes for going through wormholes in other universes or get people's hopes up that there are actually dinosaurs out there. Like, they don't want people to get their hopes up that happy endings can occur like real life is real life like obviously you're not gonna have a happy life like you're just gonna have to go to your job like no we need to take down the government and all have our happy endings you want to go to space you go to space right. if you want to see that dinosaur and go to Jurassic park you go go to the pacific ocean and go if you want to have those teachers that are in those comedy movies i don't watch many of them i like the more fantasy ones because obviously those are really Really cool to see that they're real. Um, but if you want to have that happy ending in those, in like in the notebook, like you can have those things. These things happen, they exist. And that's what I want to spread to everybody out on the internet that these things exist and we need to take down the government oppression. <laughs> oh, 
I, I, that's a very grim, you know, feeling about the government. I've, I've never really felt that way. Um, do you have other people on your side that also believe um, mm -hmm. in this? Yeah, we have a big Tumblr group who all believe in this and know that this is real. So we, we're a collectivist group. Wow. Ha has the government said anything to you? Do they know it? What message you're trying to spread? I mean, we've been spreading it. I, I'd only assume that they would know what's, what's going on because we, we've been pretty big. I mean, there's like 20 of us, so I mean, that's a pretty big group. So. Right, yeah, that's a lot. Yeah, so I, I assume that they know. I mean, they haven't done anything, but I mean, who knows? I mean, I talked to my other, my other theorist friend who talks about government cons theories, and uh, she believes, you know, in 9-11 conspiracies. So I mean, the government, oh. yeah, oppression. Yeah. A lot of people think the government is bad news. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, th I think you're going to have my friend on some other time in a couple of weeks, I oh. believe. I look forward to that then. Mm -hmm. um, so why would, if all of this, these things are actually real, why would government want to cover it up? Like, let's say, you know, that, you know, black holes are real, why would they not want us to discover them and see them for ourselves? Or if the dinosaurs are real, why are they making us believe that they're not? It's the same reason why uh, they could have found cures for cancer by this point, because they just don't want progression. Like if, I mean, they, they could have found a cure if they really put their minds to it, but they don't want to because... Well, but that's on the scientists, it's better, the government. It's better holding them back, though. No, no, they could have, do they could have done it. They could have done it, so... Um, I really believe that the government just wants to hold back a lot. Interesting. That's, that's a very interesting view. I'm going to definitely think about this a lot more now. Good. That, that's, that's our goal. The 20 of us really want people to start knowing. Yeah. I hope a lot of viewers um, also get on the bandwagon and try and, and yeah. spread your message for progress. Yes. Against oppression towards progress. Right. That's, our, that's our message. No more... Uh, not believing in Star Wars and Jurassic Park, uh, that needs to stop. Oh, well, yes, I, I definitely agree. Thank you so much for being here Thank today. you for having me. I love talking to you. Same. Thanks for watching Into the Abyss. I'll see you next time.